Hello everybody, welcome back to XCOM 2, Johnny here. Got a new bond. Mox and Chris. Sure. Uh... Yeah. Nice picture. We got a bunch of supplies and for the first time ever we don't have any reds down here. Alright, let's go into... Engineering, build items. What do you have for me? We're gonna build these, perhaps. The upgrade to the Templar class. We're gonna do this in due time, but not right now, necessarily. Go ahead and build me another medikit. I don't think we need an extra blue round. EMP grenade? Not necessary just yet. It's been slow going, but I've made headway interfacing our equipment with the we'll keep it there. still embedded throughout the ship. Already got a project Most going, let's timers. jump into it. Intel, okay. Yo, faster, were we doing something already? Did you expect that I would be fearful at the news of your discovery? You may be aware of my movements. But it will change nothing. Can I actually go into the Chosen's stronghold here? I don't know if we want to do that on this episode, to be honest. I think we're gonna roll a make contact. Don't have intel for that. Okay, grab some intel. That's fine. Avenger plotting new course. Still triggered because we haven't rescued our two units. Someday. Someday we'll do that. Plasma grenade. A concussive grenade augmented by alien energy pulse tech. The plasma does more damage than standard frag grenade and is more effective at shredding enemy armor. Advanced explosive. Now we can use those skills to upgrade our entire ar arsenal. Okay, very good. Advanced explosives. Interesting choice. Get I'll cracking. As soon as we're finished, Commander. Our action together is complete, Commander. Improved swords. All right. Form soldier bond, perhaps. Although a breakthrough wouldn't be bad. Give me a breakthrough. Sure. Um, let's do some sharpshooter action. Scientist. Risk of wounded high. Okay, we're gonna have to dispose of another soldier here. the job done. Don't worry, Commander. Let's make sure the Scilab is busy. It is busy. Alright, let's jump into it. Strategic resource located. Okay, it's not a lot, but something. Still don't have enough to make contact, that's our covert action. Avenger well, I suppose we'll course. do the facility mission here. Overwatch shots will always miss Advent Troopers. Dude, that really sucks. Continue your train. It's Kism. Insanity now does does a <laughs> does a small amount of guaranteed damage and applies rupture to the target. That seems amazing. Soul fire is also good. Who we'll goes Kism, dude? Review upgrade. 
And another cell to the side lab and uh, allowing... We already have that, don't we? Yeah, this is upgraded. Okay, facility lead. Our people seem to work well together, Commander. Uh, why don't you go ahead and reduce some more? Reduce some more. We'll send Eka and we'll send Cat. 25 supplies? Sure. My kind will do whatever is needed. What is the upgrade here? An additional slot for XCOM to assign resistance orders. Insufficient power. Huh. How about an upgrade here then? Power relay upgraded. A little bit extra power there. Resistance ring. Can now do this. So we covert action. Forces deployed on a covert action, Commander. We won't be able to initiate another operation until the current one is complete. Lock an additional XCOM to assign resistance orders. Now where did we go about assigning the orders? Resistance orders, let's go. Okay. All resource rewards from scanned rumors are doubled. Any faction? Oh, I see. It can be any faction. Plus two power. There's a chance an advent unit will join the XCOM squad. Speed of all armor research is increased. I thought we could add a new thing here. Is that not the case? I'm a little confused. Okay, whatever, man. Solace completed. Void Rift. This is amazing. We're gonna get a whole bunch of abilities before we bring them to to the fight. Soldiers, but what about all those civilians, Commander? Any idea how many you've lost out there? The Chosen are gonna do whatever it takes to get to you, Commander. Even if that means wiping out entire camps of resistance supporters. We're their only line of defense. So we can't really make I contact. Because we're lacking intel, so why don't we just grab yeah. some intel? Right. Turning I out to be a little bit of a slower board. episode. Think of it as mercy. Most of them don't even have time to notice their dead. We might have to start cutting these you in half if they become like an hour every time. But now you must face it directly. Oh, dude! Let's rescue Toft. This is the mission we deserved. So, plasma grenades. I like it. So that's just a squad upgrade. Fantastic. Who has... I'm trying to think, man. Who has, like, a lightning hand? Not entirely sure. I do like Zariel. We'll bring him on. Also like Sleeve. And I like him with a, an extra medikit too. I like you with like a blue rounds. Petra's gonna roll the mimic beacon. And we'll call it good, man. a fairly balanced squad Sky Ranger deployed We're in the pipe 5 by 5 5 by 5 
recon picked up a weak distress signal coming from this area. The resistance confirmed it's one of their codes, so we're moving in to provide an emergency extraction. We'll need to secure the area and escort the VIP to the evac point. Stay alert for hostile contacts. Menace 1-5, target coordinates incoming. Secure the VIP and proceed to the evac volume for extraction. Advent already knows we're here, so your position isn't concealed for the extraction. It's cool that Toft has, like, a weird suit. In other words, he doesn't have all of his gear and stuff, which makes sense. We have 12 turns to go there. Dude, it doesn't seem that bad. I don't do favors. We're probably gonna do yellow moves, but I like starting with a blue move first. Just in case we encounter any enemies. Dragonova is concealed, which is cool. No enemies there, so dude. We're going in. We're going all in. Let's go. So tomorrow morning I have a, a meeting at the state yeah, agent. And I'll know whether or not Good. I got the flat that I told you about in the last episode. Pretty excited about that. So, uh, give me your energy tomorrow morning. Which, uh, now that I think about it, will be today morning for you. So, a couple hours from now, that's by the time you're watching this, that's when I'll be there. So, kind of weird to think about it like that, but... Give me your energy. I'm not sure it was necessary to... To break the window, though. I'm pretty sure it wasn't the best idea you've had. So I had a pretty bad crash. And upon loading I found that... <laughs> the last load file... Is very early on. So, <laughs> sadly... We lost a lot of progress. I was actually like 15 minutes into the video and I was all the way over here. I was sort of skirting the edges of the map trying to avoid enemies. It didn't turn out to be the greatest because actually copy, good copy. there are like 12 enemies inside of this building and they all popped on me. So we were basically making a, a run for it trying to escape. So, might as well take advantage of the reloads that we didn't necessarily want to do. Moving out. But what we'll do instead is address these guys first. I know where you are. <clears throat> and see how that works. Try a different approach. You do have to be careful, though. Find another way. Yeah, we don't want to trigger any of them. Um, uh, sure. I suppose you can give me a hack. You know? Like, the hacks don't do that much, honestly. Like, um, failing is very heavy, and so you can never afford to do that, you always have to go for this one. Which usually is not that great, but... I suppose in this case it, it's better than anything else we could have done, so... There we go. I won't let them pass. Okay, we're back.
do we have like a shredder attack? I think the play here has to be use Dragonova. I am trusting the you. time for hiding is over. Get some vision of on these guys. Then you're gonna go shredder gun doesn't reach. Fuck. We will definitely get revealed if we move closer. Don't break the window, my dude. No place for you to go now. Yeah. So much for that. There are too many enemies, man. Look at this fucking guy just strolling by. Just strolling by. You could hit those two, but, um... Like, really, you have to hit these two instead. That's pretty awesome. It's a great attack. On the way. You actually can't do shit. Fifty-six percent. Jesus, man. Sixty-two percent. It's no bueno. Fifty percent. Whiskey Petro. Move in like so. How about like a grenade option? Too small to hit two enemies. So I think at this point you're looking at a uh, mimic beacon play. And then Dragonova. I don't think you focus the Archon. I think finishing off that guy is critical. Not critical. Um, what I mean is that's the most impactful thing we can do. Um, Toft, just stay safe, dude. Whatever. Then Johnny got closer. Perhaps a combat protocol on... Doesn't do double damage. So I think really... The play here is a grenade. Blow up this guy's cover. It might give Reg a good enough of a shot to make a difference. Hmm, not really. Okay. Well, I suppose we might as well. The other thing we could do is this. If any of them move, we should get shots. Why don't we try that? And then, sure. We'll take a shot. Not super surprised. Come on, Reg. Very nice, dude. That's already worth it, man. One thing I didn't realize is that the Mimic Beacon is probably best employed by very tanky recruits. Because of course the Mimic Beacon HP depends on on the HP of who casts it. Uh, 
So it's gone now, but saved us quite a bit of damage. Problem is this guy is gonna do a nasty attack. That's the acid AoE attack. Probably the worst attack in the game. In terms of damage. Okay. We're bound. And burning and everything. Alright. Of Can we get our turn, please? Can we get our turn? Okay. So, first off... Take the heal on Dragonova. Should remove the fucking acid shit. And you still have another heal in the backpack. Oh man, you just you have no good positions to go to. Even at the risk of taking extra damage, we gotta get Reg into the game here. Do we have a three-man grenade? No. But we have one that kills two people. I think that's good enough. Nope, didn't get the kill on the other guy. Okay, so... Gonna throw a heal. Dragonova. Why don't you claim or this? You're doing eight damage with that. Now we wait. Almost killed the. Uh, actually killed him, but of course he still lives. So, don't have a whole lot left. Sixty-eight percent chance. I think you gotta go for for the guaranteed combat protocol. It will end your turn, so just take the heal first. Sure. On Petro, since he has the poison bullshit. Okay. We're gonna combat protocol this guy, which enables Zariel to attack. So we got one more unit to work with. And the people we have are Sleeve and Petro. And, of course, Zarium. 97%. Here's the play. You get this. Sorry. What though? You missed a 97% shot. Wow. That is just remarkable. Make way, make way. 
Well, I suppose we're gonna heal you, man, but um, don't think you've earned it that much. See if this works. Or you could just give, yeah, just give yeah, Zariel the teamwork. If we miss two 97% shots, I'm just gonna flip the table and rage quit. I'm gonna get hit by this fucking guy, which sucks. How did you miss? That is remarkable. Shut the fuck up, Central. All right, um... Yeah, we're gonna move out, man. Do we have people that need heals sort of desperately? All right, we'll give Dragonova one. Counter trauma program activated. Fall behind and you're on your own. Should be a kill with blue rounds. And is. Okay. So now we're making our way to here. We got eight turns. There are many enemies in here. So. Поехали. We're gonna take it slow try to not trigger enemies volk says i am to obey cover me i'm reloading yeah great go <laughs> yeah that's what i meant go completely out of cover that's exactly the tile i meant to click on We get a free overwatch anyways. For fuck's sake. Mm, I have to kill him. Oh man. You can never escape my sight. So we got a big mech. Not like from McDonald's, but you know. Two regular dudes. How do you approach this? Well, we can't really move, because we'll get hit by the overwatches. And the range on their overwatch seems to be a little bit bigger than ours. At least their accuracy is better, so... Why don't we open with this? And I think you still... I don't know, man, it's tricky, because if you don't focus the Stun Lancer... ...and if he gets an attack off... ...it would be disastrous. 79%. Reg has the blue rounds, which I, I want to use if I can. Oh, man can only hit that guy, huh? I'm gonna risk getting hit on Petro. It worked. Kill him. Let's go. No, we didn't go. One HP left. Fuck me. I will go. We're gonna have to devote another character. No, you don't. Get the fuck out of here. She's not in range. No place for you to go now. I don't want to have to deal. Fuck off, man. I can't let that happen again. What the fuck? Jesus. 
Okay. Combat protocol for one damage. <laughs> That's the most ridiculous shit I've seen. I just have the worst luck in this game, man. Huh, <sighs> citizens leave. You've got a heal, you got the chance to haywire. Reg could dead eye and if he gets it, he will do a lot of damage. 66%. Oh, okay. We need a miracle. Go, Reg. Let's go! Pack defense reduced. Hunker down. Um. Won't do enough damage. So why not just do a hack attempt? Even if we miss, 9 HP is low enough that giving it additional defense is not gonna be a big problem. And if we manage to control it, it would be GG, so we'll take the gamble. Let's go, it worked! So funny enough, it says hack defense was reduced, but the percentage to hack did not change at all. So it was the same chance to get the hacks or not, which is interesting. And makes me think that uh, it doesn't affect the actual percentage numbers. Here we go, Sectopod, Wrath Cannon, an extremely high energy attack that deals damage in a long line. I know there are guys in there, I kind of want to do this. What is this? High stance? That guy will attack us, so why don't we do this? Missed. <laughs> How many turns do you have, man? You have a lot of turns. Um. Ultimately, that's fine. The only issue is that the Overwatch could hit us. As you order, Commander. But I'll take my chances. Wouldn't have killed her even with a crit, so Advent soldiers loiter carelessly. Not carelessly anymore. Oh man, what do we do? I just don't know how to play this. Um, I suppose we'll go into the full cover, at the very least. We'll maybe make a run for it. I just, I really don't know. Big off. Take your free reload. Do you have anything, Reg? Well, at this point you gotta take some risks, man. 
Есть, выполняю. But a plasma grenade. I mean, with this, you will do some damage to it, but it doesn't seem to make much difference. Instead, you probably just I want some cover, at least. Full cover for Toph. And... Go like this. Dude, missions are so difficult lately. It's kind of crazy. Hopefully, these guys will fight each other. Nope. No such luck. Holy warrior. Okay. Well, some people at least are in extraction range. I know where you are. Just missing Don't every shot. It. Okay. I don't think we can kill these fucking guys, even if we wanted to. Like your furthest move looks like something like this. I mean, this is kind of weird, but I suppose we're making a run for it now. I don't know, man. I don't have the answers as it's been clearly established but whoever can escape will try to do so why do they get free overwatches that doesn't seem right outrider watch my back and then Toft. Toft has to be fucking careful, man. He's got like no HP. What about the Sectopod? He didn't do the laser attack, which is kind of annoying. Or maybe he did? I don't know. Suppose he did. Right, my dude. Move here. What the fuck did you do? What is high stance? Transition to high stance granting a height bonus against ground enemies. This action is free. Okay, the animation is just broken, isn't it? How? It is 80% chance, come on, dude. There you go, fuck you. Johnny's getting out. Oh, okay. Zariel. Still him. You would be short. Well, I suppose we're going for it. Слушаюсь. 
Same for sleeve. YOLO. Attack the sectopod, you fuck. How do you crit from there? How do you even see my guys on the roof? Oh, man. Oh, God. Yeah. Well, Sleeve, I'm sorry to say, my dude. I think that's a wrap for you. I mean, this could do it, though. You're a fucking choir boy compared to me! A choir boy! So, kill the sectopod. I'm coming to bring it we have to terrific, we right? have to buy sleeve <laughs> so, you know, shut heaven. the fuck up rage we have to buy sleeve another turn somehow i mean reg is still there you can still do stuff plasma grenade is not very good doesn't even land on anybody could land on this guy I thought that would remove the Holy Warrior buff. Clearly, I was wrong. Oh man. Where do you go, Toft? No safe places. Oh man. Oh, he's got 5 HP. If they just look at him in a bad way, he's dead. So... We got Zario, and we got Reg. That's it. We're never getting through that shield. Okay. We gotta cut our losses. Whoever can escape, do so. That's my exit cue. So, the problem I have with these situations is if the enemies were on the high ground and we were on the low ground, so the opposite of this situation, we would not have vision on them. However, somehow they do have vision on us the entire time. Bigger. Which, to me, it breaks sort of my tactical immersion. Because for the most part, XCOM is very fair, and enemies have uh, the same rules to contend with that you do. That guy is dangerous, man. This guy is super dangerous, too. He's in Overwatch. Interceptors are on high speed approach. Your window for extraction is closing. So, here's the moment of truth. You could do this, it's a 71% chance. Why would you do it? Because that cancels the Overwatch. I think you have to. Okay, so that cancels. Sorry, that cancels the Overwatch. I need more Otherwise, either Toft or Sleeve would probably die. With my luck, one of them would have been hit. For sure. Instead, what we'll do is keep Dragonova there. She's in a high cover spot. Should be okay. We'll extract her on the next turn. Come on, come on. Okay. 
Get the fuck out of here. Jesus. Nice dodge. Everyone has permanent overwatch? What the fuck happened? Why does everyone have free overwatch? Okay. I hate this mission, man. The last few missions have not been enjoyable. Status confirmed. Mission Jesus fuck. Get me out of here. Just too many enemies, man. According to Advent officials, recent attacks by dissident elements operating outside of the city centers have done little to slow the progress of Advent's ongoing development or... But somehow we got out without losing anybody. As long as there's even one Reaper left standing, you can bet Promotion. there's still fight. Finger on the trigger. Volatile mix. Dragonova. Kill shots increase crit chance. Kill zone. Very good. Sting. Fire a shot while in shadow. Guaranteed to remain in shadow. Um. I'll get kill zone. For now. And Toft Hello, is back. Commander. Fucking difficult to get, man. What do we have? Ali and Cat are bonding. Okay. Give him a pick. I hope you're ready to be famous. Cool. All right, we'll leave it off. I'm pretty tired, guys. But we made it through another mission, not unscathed, but without any deaths. I hope you enjoyed the episode. Let me know down below if you did. And as always, thanks for watching. Catch you next time.